wheel's not spinning, you could, gravity can easily, that torque is the only torque, that torque is going to create the angular momentum, right? If it's not spinning, there's no angular momentum. So that torque, over a little bit of time, will create angular momentum totally pointing that way, meaning the wheel is rotating like this. Okay, and the wheel will just fall down. If the wheel just falls down when it's spinning, it means there's a quick change in angular momentum. And it's not even in the direction of the torque. It can't happen. The wheel can't just plop down. Watch the angular momentum vector chase the torque vector. Oh. <laughs> it keeps chasing the torque, chasing the torque, oh my God. chasing the torque. It's trying to catch up with the torque, but the torque keeps rotating away, so it's always 90 degrees. That's chasing that. And it's not falling. It's going to fall then, just spiraling yeah, down. Yeah, it's spiraling Due to down. friction, the angular momentum becomes less and less, and then that torque is having the desired effect more and more. Yeah, it's going to spiral down. Let me do that again. Oh, shit. Whoa. If it just plopped down, ju if it just plopped down, that would be like a truck going 100 miles an hour, and I go boom, and all of a sudden it just moves that way. You can't alter the angular momentum arbitrarily quickly. So guys, this is called precession. All right? The wheel, if you look over here a second, the rotation of the 